Hi, I'm Juliet's mom, and I am going to show you how you can make your American Girl doll into a boy doll if you decide. Um, once you do it, you can't go back. So you want to make sure. I actually didn't want to change any of mine, but this one I rescued from a fire, and it was a Samantha, and she had um, black all over her face, and her hair was nasty, so we had to work real hard on her on her hair. I paid like two bucks for her, so I had wanted to turn a doll into a boy doll. I just didn't want to use one that was a valuable one, and since this one was kind of messed up anyway, I cleaned her up real good and um, decided to go ahead and make a boy doll for my son, who was under one at the time, but I didn't have a girl at that time, and so I was wanting to have a doll for him. <laughs> he wanted to ever dress one so anyway this is Sam I will try to get a close-up this is one of the outfits that my friend made for me it's an awesome seamstress and uh, I'll just actually scoot it over there he is um, I had a barber cut his hair and um, actually I didn't like the way he did it so I really worked on it and I steamed it which I got that idea off YouTube and um, the steamer works wonderfully so if you have a doll with dry hair and then let me see if I can oh I'm sorry <laughs> let me see if I can get there I had to the guy that cut his hair did big gouges so I didn't do that in fact I actually fixed it and made it look a little better so the hair before was always it would never stay down it was anything anytime you moved it it would stick up and so now I've got it all nice and soft and layered and there's the back of the outfit let me set this back down so you can see it and I really need some knee highs there's his little shoes some knee socks but this this was the best I had so put it back up here this doll's legs I'm going to have to fix also because um, it seems like he's pigeon-toed. Okay, now I'm going to show you, um, so basically you can get an old doll, probably find it at a yard sale that is not in good shape at all. You hardly have to pay any money for it. And then, um, you know, if you look online, there's lots of ways that will tell you how to clean your doll. And how to restring them and how to fix their hair so anyway this is Sam and I want to show you some clothes that we use to um, out to outfit Sam alright and I use a lot of American Girl doll clothes because a lot of them can be either way so the first one is the fishing outfit this is a retired one so you have to probably find it on eBay but you'll remember this one if you know how to research outfits online. And um, it has a little dim shirt, fishing, and then I have the boots. It goes with it. Okay, and this hat that's reversible. So as you can see, it doesn't matter if a girl or a boy wears this. Okay, he would look fine in it. Okay, and then it has fish with it. You can kind of see my outfits. I have them laying here. Okay, and um, then you can always use a soccer outfit. I chose one that looked like a boy, a blue one. And I don't care if something says American Girl and it doesn't matter to me. But um, the blue one, obviously I don't want my Sam wearing a pink shirt. So, not that there's anything wrong with guys wearing pink, but I just didn't want him wearing that. Okay, and then this is the outfit that my friend made for me. And I then took the hat and the boots from a non-American horseback riding outfit and I put it with it okay and then um, let's see I'll show you some more American girl clothes in a minute I've got some issue here with my there with my camera tripod um, and then I met somebody on a chat site American girl chat site that made boy underwear for if you had a boy American Girl doll. So he's got white briefs on right now. Then I'm not going to pull his pants down. And then I ordered 
here's some cam camouflage pair. <laughs> Are they cute? Okay. And then this one actually glows in the dark. It has insects that glow in the dark. I think they're a dollar a piece, I think. I can't really remember. Maybe two dollars. And then little airplanes. And I got these because um, I figured my son would like that for his doll. And then this one is like a transportation one. And then he's got a white pair on. Okay, and I don't know if you saw his saddle shoes. And like I said earlier, I need some knee socks because... This is an outfit that matches one of my sons that he's going to be wearing for Easter. He's two and a half. Okay, and then I bought some pajamas off eBay. I tried to find the closest look to look like a boy. And this one had dogs on it. And so it looked boyish to me. And then the pants. And... Then these are some non-American things that I get things in all the time, big lots and stuff. So I just pull out things that can be useful. Um, jean jacket that a boy could wear. Overalls that a boy could wear. Some blue shorts. This is a bitty baby cap, but it works for him. Um, a bitty baby top that just came. I don't remember how I got this and. I think it was just kind of in something I was buying anyway, and I thought I could use it for him. And then just some jeans, okay? And these are non American Girl stuff, but you know, you can get jeans through American Girl too. I'm sure if you go through your clothes, you will be surprised at how many things could be a boy's outfit. Okay, and then two more outfits I have here. Um, the, I think this is a hiking outfit, okay? There's this with the shorts, the khaki shorts. And then this goes over it. And then hiking boots. These are older American girl things that have been retired a long time ago. Here's the socks that go with it. And then his backpack um, has a bandage in it. And let's see what else. Has um, a thermos binoculars, a lantern, it actually works, but I don't know if this one does, no, this one needs a battery, okay, and um, a watch, it's like a compass watch actually, and then a little emergency first aid kit with scissors in it, and it's supposed to have some other things too, but and then this outfit, I can't remember what it's actually called, but it comes with this plaid shirt, and um, here's a hat that it comes with some shoes. This does say American Girl, but it's covered up anyway by the plaid shirt, so it doesn't matter to me. And, you know, a little hoodie. And then little cargo type pants. And then you can take any of the horseback riding outfits, because girls, guys, seem to wear about the same. And um, I have the top under it. And then there was actually an American Girl one that they came out with at one time also. And that, is, you know, has this harder hat. So, and some nice boots. And so I'm going to put him in this sometime, I think. There's the pants for it. And then the jacket. Okay, so he'd be okay in that too. So anyway, that's how you can turn an American Girl doll into a boy if you want a boy. I have a kit also from that same house fire that um, has, i got to clean her up. She's got ash all over her face. But I'm thinking I might turn her into a boy also. And if I do, I'll show you before and after and how she looks with a haircut. All right, well, good luck if you choose to get an American Girl doll that you can turn into a boy. Make sure that you get a cheap one and have a professional cut their hair because it's hard to do. Thank you for watching.